Richard, well done. Obviously, the saucers really benefited from gelding and uh, showed some nice pace today and ran all the way to the line. Yeah, um, you know, obviously before the race I spoke to Louis, he said to me, oh, um, he felt, always felt like a horse that's a little bit uh, laid-backed and you know, could definitely do with the gelding. But uh, yeah, it all worked out to plan. Uh, just definitely felt like a horse that um, can do with a bit more ground and um, obviously being a maiden handicap, 55 kilos, uh, Louis could do that after the Christmas pudding, it would have been a great day for him. But, uh, he was quite transparent about the horse, so well done to him and obviously to Mr. Crawford and the team. Um, lovely horse and obviously more to come from him. Did you have a good Christmas? Yeah, very good. Uh, obviously, just a little bit too short and flew out to um, Kazarin to ride and I was a bit worried because late in the day I had a couple of 54s, so I was probably one of the happy chaps uh, not having to, to race and sweat on the day. So, yeah, good day nevertheless. Nice to have you in the winner's enclosure. Well done. Thank you very much. And also to my sponsor, the Winning Form, uh, for their ongoing support. Well done, Richard Free, the winning rider. With regards to number six, Champagne Mac, son of Trippy, trained by Brett Crawford. Brett, well done. Thanks, Vicky. Lovely to see a horse, you know, from just sort of turn that corner and come to hand. Yeah, look, um, you know, he definitely showed the improvement after um, his gelding in his last start. Um, but um, I feel he's, he, he's a horse that's still strengthening and maturing. Um, you know, these open mating handicaps are always a bit tricky. But as Richard said, you know, he, he is a horse that I think is better than a 65 rating. So uh, I must just say very well done to McCunt. Um, you know, he's got a lot of horses in training and um, he's been very patient with this horse. So uh, big thanks to him and thank him for his support. And uh, well done to Cloverfly. Brett, with regards to the horse, is he very straightforward and easygoing? Yeah, look, he, he wasn't in the beginning, Vicky. He was tending to over-race and do things back to front. Um, but since we've cut him, he's definitely uh, become a better horse. Um, and he showed that in, now, obviously, in his last two starts. And, you know, today was pretty simple. Richard just looked after him. And then when he got after him, he kicked clear of them and always looked hard for them to peg him back. Great, well done for the win. Perfect, thank you. Thank you very much to Brett Crawford uh, in relation to number six, Champagne Max and Trippy. And as uh, Brett rightfully thanked Clive Flestart for owning and well done to Mr. Gujuda for owning. Very straightforward tough horse and looks like he will gone from here. And our Hollywood Bets winning groom for race number three is Dundeni from Crawford Racing. A massive congratulations to Champagne Mac and you, our Hollywood Bets winning groom, Mr. Dundeni. Uh, please tell our viewers at home and here on course, uh, what are you going to do with the money? Uzo inzani le imali. So tengela uma uma so tengela uma uma amin pas. Okay, all the best to mom and. Congratulations again for being our Hollywood Bets winning groom for race number three. There we have it here at Hollywood Bets Kenworth. I'm super excited for more races to come. I hope you are as well as, as you're watching at home or well here on course. If you're not here, where are you? I'm ready for race number four. Are you here at Hollywood Bets Kenworth? <laughs>